70, 70% of the country wants universal single-payer health care. That's the statistic, right? Most people believe in a universal health care coverage for all people in the country. There's 30% of you who disagree. But the, the vast majority get it. Right? So Donald Trump, uh, President Trump, just has done a colossal belly flop on health care. Right? He thinks we're going to get something much better. Remember his campaign promise? We're going to get something much better. The Republicans are going to be the party of health care. Remember? Now that's his new line. The Republicans are the party of health care. So here he is. So Trump backs off vote to end Obamacare. We'll wait until 2020 election. <laughs> after. Wait till after the 2020 election. Damn, he's pushing shit back, man. Fucking Donald Trump. Donald Trump doing a colossal one of these. Here he is. Pow, fucking, that's a belly flop right there. That is a belly flop. Why? Because he doesn't have anything. They got nothing, right? Here's the statistic, right? 70%. Bernie Sanders said it. 70% of the country wants Medicare for all, single-payer health care. How come Donald Trump can't get it? Before we talk about that, though, uh, everybody kindly go over to Marcus Conti 2 and hit that subscribe button so that uh, that's the uh, channel in case this channel, in case I disappear, you know, for, for telling the truth, right? You know, you know where to find me. Also, become a Patreon. This is Sparta. Spartans live here. We got, uh, you know, we're trying to get up to 300 strong Spartans, become a truly self-supporting through our own contributions uh media media movements so uh so here's so here's trump right trump uh thought there's no stopping though there's no stopping a lawsuit this is zero hedge reporting no stopping a lawsuit brought by the administration and more than 20 state AGs seeking to finally declare Obamacare unconstitutional. The Republican Party's last push to throw out Obamacare and place it with something better and affordable has officially been canceled by Trump. We all agree that Obamacare is a shit sandwich. Obamacare was a compromise in 2008 where Obama ran on a platform of universal single-payer health care and the party of of healthcare, the Republicans shut it down, right? They made them, they made, they convinced Obama within a few months that it's not possible. It will cost too much. Your, the taxes will triple. Everybody will hate you, right? It was all bullshit, right? So that's what Obama care was. It was a shit sandwich compromise. And, uh, but the real shit is the real sandwich is Medicare for all. So, um, so here's Trump in his own words. Here's his tweets of this week. Everybody agrees that Obamacare doesn't work. Yeah, we do agree with that. Premiums and deductibles are far too high. Yeah, agree. Really bad health care. Even the Dems want to replace it. But with Medicare for all, which would cause 180 million Americans to lose their beloved private health care insurance. Stop. <laughs> The, the the 180 million Americans. This is the big lie. Would would um, would would lose cause cause them to lose their beloved private health care. What beloved fucking private health care? What are you talking about? Right? You you all you do is you're you're giving people health insurance. You're giving them you're giving it to them. They don't need their private bullshit. Right now, people want to create uh, insurance for like, you know, plastic surgery or braces or fucking, you know, other cosmetic. You want a facelift, you want new tits, you want a bigger ass, you want fatter lips, right? That kind of crap, right? If you want to pay more, go ahead and pay. Nobody's stopping you. We're talking about a basic coverage for all Americans. God damn it. So he goes on. The Republicans are developing a really great health care plan with far lower premiums and deductibles than Obamacare. <laughs> Bull fucking shit. There is nothing, absolutely nothing the Republicans have, have concocted. All they want to do is end Obamacare, right? Get rid of it and then let the pieces fall and then we'll make money <clears throat> inventing something new. It's total bullshit, right? The answer is single-payer health care. Excuse me. 
<clears throat> in other words, it will be far less expensive and much more usable than Obamacare. Bullshit. Has not been proven to be the case. And uh, because why? And I'll show you why. I'll show you why in a second. Because you have to, when single-payer health care, what it does is the single-payer is the government. And what you're doing is you're eliminating all the middlemen so that th that the insurance companies can't charge $600 for an aspirin and $8,000 to, to uh, remove a, a toenail or some other nonsense, insane pricing, right? Doctors making I don't know how many millions of dollars a year in five homes in the Hamptons and six Mercedes Benz and, and you know, and five children in uh, Ivy League schools, right? We've got to end all that bullshit if you want to become a healthcare worker right if you want to be a millionaire go go be a millionaire but if you want to work in healthcare let's bring it back down to size let's bring it back down to size so people can be covered in other words it will be far less expensive and much more usable than obamacare wrong vote vote will be taken right after the election when republicans hold the senate and win back the house Moving the goalposts, right? Trump has said nothing. All he's talked about is the wall. Nothing on health care. Going to make something better. Doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about. Also, Republicans will always support pre-existing conditions. Great. Single-payer health care supports pre-existing conditions. Everybody is covered, right? So that argument, the stupid argument of pre-existing conditions and the stupider argument that every, that 180 million people want to hold on to health care that's killing them and draining their draining their resources is stupid. They're two ridiculous arguments. The Republican Party will be known as the party of great health care. Meantime, the U.S. is doing better than ever and is respected again. Ah, uh, fucking Trump. So look at these numbers, right? So who, the five... Top five largest healthcare companies. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> that's what it is, right? It's a giant belly flop, right? It's, that's what this that's what whole thing. So here's the, here's the problem. Why can't you get universal health care for all? Because the middlemen are making so much money. Uh, they're making so much money, the insurance companies. Here's just the top five. Right? Money in their hands. Ah, la, 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 the love of money. The love of money. United Health Group, net, uh, what is this? The uh, net revenue, $184 billion. $184 billion. 70 million subscribers. Next one, Anthem. Anthem, $89.1 billion in revenue. 39, 39 million slaves on the rolls. Aetna. 21 million slaves, $63.1 billion in net revenue. Humana, $54.3 billion, 14 million slaves. Cigna, Cigna, $39 billion. Do the math. Just do the math on these five, five big ones, right? It's, it's insane. There's 100, 200, 300, 360, 363 400 billion dollars a year thrown at insurance companies do you see the problem do you see the problem where the where they're, they're bleeding and a lot of this is not out of pocket people paying this is this is your you know I, I mean I, re, I I give you an example I used to work for the city right city of New York and and they used to pay like sixteen hundred dollars per month per person just to cover an employee. Right? They're raping, you see that the insurance companies are raping the, the, the municipalities. They're taking the money from you. In a single-payer system, that stops. That goes down. The price goes down. Why is it so hard to understand? Why do 70% of the country, why does it when it's pulled, 70% of the country wants it, but the president of the United States says, we can't have it because it'll because he's saying he's saying what is he saying he's saying that that 180 million people don't want to lose their beloved health care it's a fucking lie right so so single payer universal health care that is the way to go it is and always has been trump is con con continuing to do his backflip his belly flop 
on health care. Let's get it done, man. Let's get it done. Why is it so hard? The universal health care for all, it's not hard. We'll give up something else. We'll, well, how about this? We take, we take a hundred billion dollars off of the, off of the, uh, the idea of going to Mars. We'll take it out of NASA's, NASA's pocket, right? The, the moon landing, right? We need another moon landing. We did, how about the other, the first one? Was that a, uh, <clears throat> did we even, that happen? Who knows? I don't know. Cause you're not even allowed to talk about anything anymore, but why is why is why are we giving all this money to to for to go to Mars to to watch a, a Hollywood production of Mars when we could give you know people health care and in, in, in this country right that's what that's what social programs are designed to do you have to move the money around right we have you know socialized uh, fire department and and the police department and and all the other programs like the parks and and museums and all this stuff that that regular people enjoy as part of a a, a civilized society, freeways, bridges that that connect connect us to the other side, right? This is all this is all signs of a modern society, railways and and buses and trains that take us around, right? That's what it's all about, right? Programs to keep the highways clean. These are programs that we fund, right? Well. We have to fund single payer health care, right? And the the actual funding of that would be much less, right? So so it's not socialism, right? I know I know that word, it's weaponized. I know the mainstream media has done a number on on the vast majority of the American people. And when they hear universal health care, it's socialism. Fuck socialism. I hate Oh, I fucking hate socialism. You fucking socialist. You motherfucking socialist. Motherfucking Venezuela. Eat your fucking dog, motherfuckers. I see you guys sound like to me. I mean, that's what it sounds like. When you say, when you when I say universal health care, you say fucking motherfucking socialism. I hate that. I hate that fucking dog. I'm a fucking socialist. I'm a fucking Republican. I'm a fucking American. What the fuck is wrong? You don't you see a fucking flag over there? Fucking American. Fucking gay. Fucking. Marcus Conti reporting. Uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe and subscribe to the uh, to the backup channel because uh, who knows? You know who knows what uh, YouTube has in store. Marcus Conti reporting.